So the Boundary Commission role is actually an OIC, an Order and Council appointment. The focus is the Alberta-British Columbia boundary. So in Canada, the provincial boundaries or the interprovincial boundaries are actually within the Constitution, within the Constitution Act. And so we have a Boundary Commission. Uh, my counterpart in Alberta, the Director of Surveys in Alberta, is the Alberta Boundary Commissioner, the Surveyor General of Canada Lands. So not the Surveyor General of Canada, but the Surveyor General of Canada Lands. Yukon, none of it, Northwest Territories, First Nations Reserves, um, certain other special Canada lands within provinces. His responsibility, he is our International Boundary Commissioner dealing with the Canada-US border, but he sits on the Alberta-BC boundary, because if you think about it, a ton of national and provincial parks along that boundary. And that boundary, for the most part, from the 49th parallel north, is actually a height of land. So it's the height of land between Alberta and BC at the top of the Rockies, the point where 50% of the water goes west and 50% of the water goes east. So we do a lot of work in maintaining that boundary, understanding where it is, becomes far more important in First Nations matters these days, um, the resource areas, and strangely, where the highway passes are. It, something I never would have guessed, but insurance becomes a big deal. So you have an accident or something occurs. So in fact, the Lake Louise ski area is an area where we maintain the Alberta BC boundary with some precision because of accidents that occur on a ski hill.